I'm Zachary Gazzaldi and I'm from Windsor, Ontario. Um, my disease is called Friedrich's Ataxia. It's a genetic disease, so I was born with it. Well, my very first symptom was when I was one years old. I had really crooked feet. And then when I was about 12, 13 years old, I started to wobble when I walk. It was very hard to do certain physical activities. I got weaker, my legs got smaller. Um, my speech became impaired, so at the age of 14, 15, I would fall almost every day, so wobble everywhere I went. Before I came, I could I could not make it a very far distance on my own. Um, I would often rely on someone to help me or a wall to help me go wherever I want to go from point A to point B. Um, even around in my own house, it would be very difficult. I would furniture walk, I would have to hold on to the furniture wherever I wanted to go, so um, it was fairly difficult. And my speech was really bad. Um, at school, the teachers couldn't understand what I was trying to tell them because my speech was so bad. Um, whenever I was tired, I would mumble or not talk at all. So um, My legs were extremely weak, and I went to the gym five to six times a week, and they still didn't improve. Um, I was able to maintain the strength, but not improve the strength. But since I've been here, I think they've gotten quite a bit significantly stronger. After my first stem cell injection to the IV in the hand, um, that's the day after I had seen my first results, and that was when I was able to bend over and touch the floor. And I haven't been able to do that since I was about 14 years old. So I'd say that was pretty, pretty cool, pretty significant improvement right there. Um, after my second or third injection, I'd say my, my speech got a lot better. Um, I called home a few times and even they thought it got better, so I'd say it was noticeably better. I'd say that my strength and my limbs have improved quite a, quite a bit and so has my flexibility in my knees before I couldn't bend my knees at all. When I would attempt to go up and down stairs I couldn't really do it because my knees wouldn't bend, but they can now, so it's a lot easier. and. Just the overall strength in my limbs and especially my legs and now when I walk I don't wobble as much. I can go a further distance on my own and if I do need help you can barely tell I'm holding on to you, stuff like that. Um, I never really had any big motor control problems. I could pretty much do everything on my own with my hands but the coordination sometimes wasn't there. And I, my sister uses chopsticks whenever she eats. And she tried to teach me forever how to use chopsticks and I could never use them because my coordination was bad. But after my first or second stem cell injection, I ate everything with chopsticks. I've eaten rice with chopsticks. I've eaten everything with chopsticks. I've just never did this before. I can never do that before. I can eat pretty much everything with chopsticks, including rice. So. Mm, I think the staff here is really good. I think everyone here is good, especially the doctors and nurses. Um, I think everyone here handles everything with care. I they've exceeded my expectations from when I first, you know, came here. I thought, you know, the hospital wasn't gonna be as good or as clean as what it was, but the hospital was very clean. Everything, the people were extremely nice. They handled everything with care. I think the staff here is actually really good. They exceed my expectations by a mile.